Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video I'm going to be showing you how to install the Discord API script from Knight Software. Before we start, I'm assuming that you will have a 5M server already created and ready to go. Firstly, you will need to download the asset from your Keymaster. The link to Keymaster will be in the description below. After you enter the website, log into your cfx.re account and click on the granted assets text. Here, you will see the product Knight Discord API. After you find it, press the blue button that says download. After the asset has downloaded, open it up by pressing on the tab at the bottom of your screen. I have WinRAW installed and it looks like this. If you do not have WinRAW installed, I'd highly recommend it. There is a link to the download page in the description below. For the next step, please enter your CFX default folder where your cache, DB and resources folder are. Then double click on the resources folder. After entering the folder, press on the new folder button. Name the folder, open square bracket, night script, close square bracket. Then go back into your CFX default folder. Upon completing this step, enter the server.cfg file. I use the application Visual Studio code which makes script easier to read for people who aren't familiar with scripting, like myself. Then scroll to the bottom of the line starting with ensure. After this, type ensure, open square bracket, night scripts, close square bracket. Press Ctrl and S to save the edit and close down the server.cfg. Re-enter your resources folder and then double click on your brand new night scripts folder. In the WinRAR file, you should see a folder called night underscore discord api. Drag and drop this folder into the folder you have open in your file explorer. You do not have to edit the server.cfg file as any folder which has a square bracket before and after the text will only have the contents of the folder read and conducted by the server. After doing this, enter the night underscore discord api folder and double click on the config.lua file. Here you will see 21 lines of script. On line 8 you can see discord underscore bot underscore token equals. This can be used if you have a custom bot created. Knight Software have created a bot which can be invited by using the link in the description down below. On line 9 you can see discord underscore guild underscore id equals. In between the speech marks you need to paste your discord server id. To do this enter the discord application. After this enter your settings. Then and scroll down to the bottom of the app settings category. At the bottom of this category you should see advanced. Go into this and enable developer mode then exit your settings. Right click on the server you are using for the 5M server and a menu should pop up next to where you clicked. Go to the bottom of this and click on the button that says copy id. Reopen the config.lua file and click in between the speech marks then hold ctrl and press v. From line 12 to line 18 there is a list of IDs and the name of the role in orange text. If you wish to configure this, enter Discord and create a new role in the Discord server by right clicking on the server then server settings. It should come up with a dashboard like this. Click on the roles button on the left of your screen and press the blue button saying create role. Name the role whatever you wish. For the purposes of this video I will be creating three roles, police officer, firefighter and paramedic. Re-enter the config.lua file and delete line 12, 13, 17 and 18. You should have police officer, firefighter and paramedic remaining. Once again, re-enter Discord. Give yourself the roles by pressing on your name at the side of your screen and press the plus or add symbol. Then add police officer. Repeat this process for every role. Click on your name, then right click on the police officer role and copy ID. Re-enter the config.lua file. Replace the current ID next to police underscore officer with the one from your server by highlighting it and pasting. Repeat this step for each role. After this, hold Ctrl and S to save the changes. Enter your web browser and enter your TX admin dashboard for the server. Then press on the live console tab. The way you check if you have installed it correctly, you should see the text, open square bracket, script colon night underscore discord close square bracket space open square bracket night underscore discord api close square bracket starting check done space api is ready using default bot token thank you for watching if you have any questions please open a ticket in the night software discord